engaged in activities which, at least to me, are questionable. These actions have weighed heavily on my conscience, and early last week, I contacted the FBI and voluntarily answered all inquiries of what I had done and of what I had knowledge. I am continuing to cooperate in that investigation in any way that I can. I have also been informed by numerous sources that there is an investigation underway into the activities of health clubs in Cincinnati. I have visited health clubs in Cincinnati on a number of occasions, but these were solely for legitimate purposes. To the best of my knowledge, no club in Cincinnati which I visited was engaged in any improper or illegal activities. These are the complete facts in this matter, facts which I can only hope the public will understand. It is my fondest wish to re-enter public life, but I believe it in the best interest of this community that I resign until such time that the air has been cleared. I wish to express my deepest gratitude to those who have stood through me or by me through this ordeal. My wife, my family, and so many friends, those both in public life and private citizens, have given me strength when I needed it most. Did you go to the authorities before or after they knew that you had visited that club and before or after? I they have no idea checks? when they knew. Did they find they your checks? Do you know? I have no idea. I went and told them on my own of what I had done, and uh, I've been cooperating fully with them. These rumors, there have been, as much as people have been very nice to me, there have also been some incredible, incredible stories uh, about me involved in some kind of ring. Do you intend to return to public life, Mr. Springer? Pardon? Do you intend to return to public life? Those of you who know me know the incredible passion I have for, for what, I'm, what I do in public life. And so uh, obviously I would love to return sometime. But I, uh, in Cincinnati, I have no desire to leave this community, which has given me so much. But uh, I've got this, this situation now, which I think is best dealt with, and not to place a burden on, uh, on anybody else. Uh, this uh, behavior, this particular incident, certainly sets a bad example for anybody else to follow, and one which I am obviously not very proud of. Uh, I hope that at least in my public service, uh, I have set a good example.